Hey everybody, it's Mac Two Three, and right now I'm doing my monitor unboxing. This is a twenty a twenty two inch, but I'm gonna cut it open fast. So there, oh, tape is on the side here. Oopsie. There we go, that side, then this side, there we go, okay, so here it comes with a disc, um, it, it just looks kind of like some sort of a setup type disc, I don't know, I'm going to sit everything over, over here, so here, com here it comes with a, um, power a, a power a screen power cable um here we go um this seems to probably be a st the screen stand i suppose maybe not exactly positive but maybe <sighs> i'm trying to see what this looks like doesn't say anything, but we'll sit it, we'll sit it over here because it looks like it has something to do with the actual device. Um, it comes with a VG, VGA to VGA cable, so that's this. Okay, um, I'm going to take this cardboard out, car, cool, cardboard, I mean, styrofoam out, and here's the monitor. Try to get it out of here. Just a second. Almost. Got it. Woo! It's a nice monitor. Okay. Okay. So here's the monitor. We're gonna take it out of its sleeve if I can figure out where it comes out of. Okay. So there's this. Um, piece that we just that I just had is um, a piece to the it's part of the stand for the this um, attaches right here right like that so um here's the monitor so this is the unboxing um the setup will also be part of this video but um, I'm gonna get that to you guys in a minute so um, thank you for watching and peace. Okay, hey everybody, it's Matthew 3 with the second, like the little continuous part of the monitor unboxing. I know you really didn't get to see it in the unboxing, I'm sorry. Uh, it was one of my first recordings with this camera, so I'm still getting used to it. But here's the monitor. Up uh, on the back. It has some ports. Um, it what it feels like a uh, DVI, and also it seems like it has a VGA, and then it has its power uh, input. Um, so yeah, here we go. Um, first, if you're gonna want to do the dual screen, what you need to gonna do is you're gonna need to go and buy yourself a mini DVI to DVI adapter. Now, I mean, I have the older, one of the older versions, and they use mini DVI to DVI, okay? So, what you're gonna do is you're gonna wanna plug this into the back of your Mac. There, it went in. Okay, so now this is, this is plugged in into the back of my computer. Now, I need to adapt this to the back of there. So what I'm going to use is I'm going to be using this uh, DVI to DVI connector. So it was in my unboxing video that I had. Okay. So see the DVI. Wait, is that DVI or VGA? That's DVI. 
DVI to DVI. Okay? So now, what you're going to do, okay? So, what you're want going to want to do, this goes in here. Just like that. You're going to want to tighten these up. I'm getting mine really tight. Can you see that? I'm hoping so. Um, so yeah, before you even do this, you need to check the back of your um, your monitor and see what it like ports are on the back, cause like um, it could be a VGA and not a DVI, cause that's happened before. That's happened on like I've watched videos on it before. So now what you're gonna do is you're gonna plug this the other DVI input into the back of your monitor so I can show you really well with that like I have okay so what you're gonna do is you're gonna make sure that you have this lined up correctly and you are going to plug this in just a second I'm getting it I need to turn it around See, that's why you need to keep make sure it's lined up correctly, so you can get it in right the first, the, in correctly the first time, and not have to go back. And then uh, just tighten up these. Okay, so everything's hooked up except for this. I hooked it up to make sure it worked, and it did. And so um, now all you gotta do is. Make sure that everything's plugged up together like this. Okay? And the screens, I don't know if you saw that, but here, let me let me do this. Okay. I the the screen the well, okay. First you're if you're if if you plug them in and nothing happens on your monitor this is can also be a TV so what you have to do is you have to go and you have to set it to DVI um and so then you're gonna come on if you're on a Mac you have to go into system preferences displays then go right here and hit detect displays if it doesn't automatically pop up but it's gonna automatically pop up for me because I just did that they're automatically gonna turn blue and now as you can see I can drag, you can drag this all the, from right there all the way over here to all the way over there. Thing. Since I have two monitors, if you keep going over, you can keep going onto one more whole screen. So, yeah, that's pretty cool, right? Um, and also, if you want to make this the dual screen your um your your like main screen you're gonna come over here and you're gonna go to a um a line this one's a lot lower like that so I'm gonna do that okay it just syncs them so now that all this space over here way over there way over there is all black now and I can't go in there but okay so anyway if you want to make the, the the your dual screen the your main screen, take this, drag it there. See now, the the dual screen over here is now your main screen. And if you want to do it back, turn it back. You're gonna to want to come back over here to where your to to your not main screen. So like my main computer. Anytime you want to switch switch them back, you just drag that bar and it sinks and both screens turn blue and that is my tutorial on how to do dual screen um, I'm thinking about doing triple screen soon if I get enough money to buy another monitor but um, yeah thanks for watching and bye